Hey everybody, Nick Newell here, uh, on my way to Tampa, get ready for my first big uh, televised fight with my coach, Jeremy Lebeshevsky, and I can tell you that at airports, all people do is eat. <laughs> I appreciate a free vacation to where I can go and beat someone up, but it's really hard when you're cutting weight and everybody's eating food in the airport. With your seatbelt right fastened, once the captain feels huh? to be safe to move Speaking about, the captain must distinguish that fastened seatbelt sign. Um, once you are free to move about, the captain orange lavatory is on uh, board. However, due to height and security measures, there's absolutely no standing line for me. I'm congregating in the fourth front. Beautiful Tampa, Florida. Beautiful Tampa, Florida. Um, we're going to wait for Scott Labrie here somewhere, meet up with him. Escalator, riding on an escalator. Escalator, going down. He's going up, these people are going up on the escalator, we're going down. There is a guy right here who has a button up shirt and a beard. <laughs> and there are a bunch of sharks on the floor. And that guy's not really working hard. And, and I can't wait to see my friend Scott. Because he's right over there. Give me a hug. You son of a bitch. We almost touched face. <laughs> touch faces. We almost touched faces on that awesome. hug. Scotty, how was your world tour, buddy? It's great. You drugged, you wake up. He drugged you from Ludlow and then you just woke up now? I only slept for a little bit. <laughs> Scott stuck you with uh, some weird guy. This guy stuck with some weird guy the whole time. He was flying out of plane, so let's take it off. <laughs> awesome. All right. Thank you. We'll be on. We'll be on Channel Nine News. I got to carry guns in Florida. <laughs> Welcome to Tampa, guys. <laughs> Not too shabby. There's Chris, he's talking on the phone. And Jer's checking in with Sky. Whoa, getting crazy in Tampa. Here's our hotel. Uh huh. <laughs> two friends. <laughs> Nothing like two friends watching a little Mythbusters, huh? <laughs> friends forever. Endeavor. Let's see. Whoa! Look at that. Wow. Um, I just—it's the day before weigh-ins, and I just got done. I did seven uh, rounds of hand pads uh, with mitts and and tie boxing, and uh, then I went and did a treadmill workout and a sauna uh, workout. So I started the day at. Uh, 155, so we'll go see and see how much I weigh. Let's see the damage. Alright, guys, back in. Alright, so. 160. Not bad. I'm good with that. The rest small. Getting ready to do his final weight cut of, the, of uh, XFC. Scott Labrie was over here going to help us out. No idea what I ate or what I weigh, but I ate a banana and an apple since you saw me last. I had a little sip of water, so I'm hoping that I'm still around 160. And Scott Labrie just got done having a big breakfast with bacon, eggs, sausage, <laughs> and uh, I had fruit. Amazing yeah, breakfast. Yeah. <laughs> okay, it's day of weigh-ins. Uh, as I predicted, I was about 160 again, so... Um, I'm going to go in the sauna for a little bit, and then I'm going to go and I'm going to hit some pads and, and uh, maybe go for a little run if necessary. Roll around a little bit. Okay. The Wizard! Uh, not as cool as I thought it would be. Show you what a real man's body looks like.
just got done doing another pad session, a, lo a little roll and a sauna session. Lanes are in a couple hours. Let's see how much I weigh right now. 155 on the dot. It was different a little while ago, so we'll have to wait and see. I'll check my. After making his weight cut, as you can see, he's a little bit irritable. Scott, Libri over here, looking great as always. How'd the weight cut go today, sir? I think it went pretty good. I didn't have a hard time. You talking about me or Nick? <laughs> we're, gonna, we're talking about Nick Newell oh, right now. Oh, yeah. And Nick did a good job. No problems at all. Nick, how are you feeling right now? I'm feeling nice. How do you feel? You just got done, you just got done with your medicals. How are you feeling now? Good. I can't wait to step on the scale so I can finally eat something and drink something. But other than that, I, I'm fine. I'm just hanging out. Like you always do at weigh-ins for a couple hours. Sweet. So how much, weight, how much water weight did you cut today? Uh, about 10 pounds. About 10 pounds water weight today? Oh, today. Yeah. All right. So about 15? The last 24 hours, yeah. All right, buddy. Maybe 12. We'll check back in a little while. Excuse me, sir. You can't come in here unless you're VIP. <laughs> We were all about what we call the next generation of MMA superstars. With the XFC, there are no easy fighters. He's got his Christmas uh, stuff. <laughs> it says a Christmas story. Dennis, is that a short story? Oh! <laughs> All right, 153 and a half. Dennis's opponent was a semi-finalist in the XFC Open Fighter Tryout in Connecticut, standing in for a buddy of his who had passed away, with a record of five and zero. Oh, Nick Newell. Good job, man. This gentleman is from Spring Hill. Was with the UFC. Been in my office a few times. Very happy to have him with the XFC. Record of 4 and 4 in the blue corner. You got it. Corey Hill. They got it right now. Right now. Good. Tight, 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 tight. Get it right to the top. Contracted 1 7. Perfect, man. I got it. Okay, hang in there. You stand there. I know. You got it. You got it. Thanks, Dennis. Dennis, you got it. We got your single shot right here. Come forward. Right here. I got it. You just want me in front of the lane. How the hell did you make 155 in the past, Corey? Tell him before you jump in. 169 and a half. How do you feel, Nick? I feel great. You have a nice, well groomed goatee, usually. You go with the beard looks tonight. Tell us about that. Well, that's just because I haven't shaved for tomorrow. It's way in there, you know. I'm going to feel a little scruffy and, and kind of out of sorts like you guys do before you, you know, get to eat. Are you going to cut it down to a... Oh, no, it's December. Never mind. Last month was the, was the mustache.